Well, welcome to this value med product demonstration video we're going to show you this eco test cholesterol meter the five in one system uh, it's a very good total cholesterol measurement high density ldl triglycerides uh, low density and the tc hdl ratio are all electronically worked out the meter itself we're going to show you the pack contents and how to set it up in this video test strips here we've got them they are test devices really come in packs of uh, 10 test devices you get capillary transfer tubes code chip and a device insert you also get supplied some safety lancets with the uh, refill packs of cholesterol devices so let's crack this meter open and show you what you get in the box so out of the box you get a mail warranty card there's no need to do that if you've purchased this online because we've got a record of the purchase date for you you get a cholesterol check device pack insert, a set of instructions which are very well written in English and give you a full and comprehensive set of instructions on setting up your meter and how to interpret and measure your blood cholesterol. And then inside this little zip pouch you get your digital meter, you get your two check device cholesterol devices and you get your four batteries so what we're going to do in the next section is pop the batteries into this meter and just show you how to set the time date and that way when you do come to do your first test your memory will not also just hold a thousand memories but it will actually have the time and date when those tests were performed so let's do that next in this video we're now going to show you how to insert batteries into the eco test meter remove the battery compartment cover and following the diagrams in the base of the battery compartment fit your four AAA batteries replace the cover turn the uh, meter over and hold and depress the power on button for one second it will show you the code test strip that I've inserted into the side port here. This is the port for the code chip that comes with a meter strips. And that goes in this side section here by firmly pushing it in. It's now ready to run its first test. But what I want to show you is how to set the time and date on this. So to do so, I'm just going to hold down the power on button and you'll see it brings me through to system menu you can navigate your way through the various elements of this but in system menu if you then press the power on off button again it will bring you through to date set which is what i want to do and you can navigate using the side buttons up and down through the different menus but when you're on the one you want which is date set press the power on button Okay, now we've got time, month and day and year. So we can navigate through these, changing the time, 14, the minute, the month, the day of the month and the year. And when you're happy with where you're at with the correct time and date then just hold the power button again down and again to come out of that menu and there we've got the correct time showing 1435 and we've set the day date and year so that in the memory when we run the tests it will give us the correct time and date for that test result we're now going to demonstrate how to perform a cholesterol test using one of the cholesterol test devices. These are individually foil wrapped and should not be removed from their foil until just before you are ready to perform the test. Now they have a front and a back section. The back section has three windows and the front section has one. Using the handle, insert the test strip until the monitor recognizes it and asks you to apply the sample. We're now going to use one of these test safety lancets. I'm just going to perform a 
safety lance, get a sample of blood, you wipe the first droplet away and then squeeze the finger to allow a good second droplet to form and then using the pipette just put it sideways and allow it to naturally fill. You can see that does so and as soon as it reaches that black mark it should stop filling. You then wish to apply the sample by squeezing the pipette into the sample well. And there we go. That sample has been applied. The monitor will read the sample and we now wait for it to do its magic and interpret the readings. Now this will take uh, several minutes so I'm going to come back and show you the results when this meter has read the cholesterol level. Okay, I have the cholesterol results showing now on this display and just let me run you through those. So the total cholesterol is 5.3 millimoles per litre, HDL 1.3, total uh, triglycerides 1.04 and my LDL is 3.55. So the total cholesterol to HDL ratio is 4 to 10 and the time and date as demonstrated on there is all recorded in the memory on this meter. So that's your first test result. Now the meter will automatically power down after five minutes, but you can now remove the test device and that can be placed back into its foil for disposal. And you can hold the power off button and it should switch off after five minutes I think and it doesn't appear to be an easy ah, there you go just one quick press on the power button and the meter now is in storage mode so it can all be placed away ready for your next cholesterol test to be done